Kumar. Welcome to my series on Power Patterns Applications. Here are two related questions. All the prime numbers less than 100 are multiplied together. What will be the last digit of the product? Question number 6 is, find the value of 4 to the power of 11. If 4 to the power of 12 is 16777216. You can always pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. So let's try to answer question number 5, which says all prime numbers less than 100. So let us list the prime numbers and see what could be the last digit when they are all multiplied. You don't really have to multiply the prime numbers. So the prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, and so on, correct? Do you notice something? I am going to multiply all these, correct? So if I multiply, I will get what? 2 times 5 will give me 10. And the pattern rule is, if I multiply numbers with 10, in that case for sure, the last digit is going to be 0, correct? So, since we are multiplying by 10, 2 times 5, we know that the last digit has to be 0. So, our answer here is 0 is the last digit. Correct? So, that is how we are going to answer. Question number 6. Find the value of 4 to the power of 11 if 4 to the power of 12 is this big number. So to get 4 to the power of 11, what should we do? We should divide this by 4, correct? We know that 4 to the power of 11 is 4 to the power of 12 divided by 4, correct? That is what we need. So let's divide this big number uh, by 4, right? So, so we have this division. I'll perform a long division. To get the answer, we have 1, 6, 7, 7, 7, 2, 1, 6. And we are going to divide this by 4. Correct? So let's do it. So 4 times 4 is 16. So, and then we have this number uh, coming down. So we have 7. So 4 times 1 is 4. So we have this 3 bring down 7. So 4 times 9 is 36, right? So bring down the next 7. So we have 1 here and 7. 4 times 4 is 16, so remainder 1. So we have brought down 3 7. So now it's the turn for 2. 4 times 3 is 12, so remainder is 0. Bring down 1, which is 0, and then 16 will go 4 times, correct? So when you perform this division, we get 4 to the power of 11 as equal to 4194304. Is that clear to you? Right? You can always check your answer. If you multiply this by 4, you should get 4 to the power of 12. So 4 times 4 is 16, right? 4 times 3 is 12. 4 times 4 is 16 and 1 17, 36 and 1 37. So 4 and 3 will give us 7 and 4 times 4 is 16. So that check is performed and is the perfect answer. Correct? So that is how we are going to answer this kind of question. So I hope you enjoyed our series on power patterns and its applications. Feel free to write your comment, share your views. If you like and subscribe to my videos, that would be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.